Hello YouTube. What you're going to see here on this footage is a regular customer of mine, Aaron. We left out early, did a little fishing in the morning on a Saturday morning. And then about 10 o'clock, we went back and picked up his wife and his little boy, Noah, who's about eight years old. And then we went out back out and did some Spanish mackerel trolling. All I can tell you is, yes, thank goodness for some business. And wow, the last few weekends out on that river and at the inlet has been unbelievable, the amount of people. I actually got tired of Spanish mackerel trolling for the sheer fact that you're just doing this with all these boats. So weekends are really quite brutal right now as far as people out on the river. So my next trip is going to be Tuesday and hopefully I'd like to see that like cut in half, cut in a quarter, cut in something. Um, but I'm thankful to have the business and thankful to have regulars that keep coming back after every trip. What I've been doing here is I've got a pump up spray bottle and I mix bleach and water in the bottle and I could do this on my boat, it's no big deal and I missed everything, I missed the coolers the, the top, the gunnels, the seats, everything and just let it mist and just dry there so just to try to keep the boat disinfected or whatever you know, I mean that's what else are you going to do? You know, so that's what I'm trying to do, and I would say uh, that's probably a pretty good practice. Other than that, enjoy the footage because me and Aaron are quite excitable. We have a good time with each other. He's a, he's a, he's a good guy, and uh, been taking his little boy fishing since he was like four years old. So, I might be losing him, though, as a customer, because the United States Navy is going to ship him back up to Virginia, Norfolk, Virginia base up there, the Navy base. So, it'll, he'll, be, he'll be dearly missed, because we always have so much fun. But in this video, footage, what you're not going to see, I believe, is Aaron. Oh, my God, what was it? He had a big fish on, a good big fish on, and he's just bringing it up. We were fishing in like 55 foot of water, dead shrimp on the bottom, good smelly shrimp. This time of year, good God, can you just use plain old dead shrimp and catch them black drum and whiting. I love whiting. I love catching big whiting. No, they're not the glory species. But boy, do they sure do eat. And uh, he lost a good fish. And then I think it was right after that, he, he had a monster whiting. I mean, a monster whiting is 14 to 16 inches, 17 inches. This past Friday, I believe it was, we fished a restricted zone in the St. John's where, you know, we're all threats to national security. And before they ran us out of there, we had some huge, huge whiting. And I'll put a picture in right now of country. That's who I took. Old country. And some of the whiting that we caught. And I'll put the picture in right now. All right, so that's it. Stay tuned. This is the footage, and uh, it's that time of year. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm happy to be staying relatively busy. So uh, keep my fingers crossed. Hope everybody is doing okay. And um, don't forget, wash your hands. Rod Cam. Let the dogs out. <laughs> Sandbagging me.
he was doing a lot of sandbagging me. I'm a guesstimated six pounder, Dave. Okay, six pounder. Six pounder. Aaron says six pounds. He was sandbagging me big time. Why'd you do that? Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, here we go. Look at that. I said, who will let them dogs out? Hit the nail right on the head. Nice drum. That's a nice drum, alright. About 24 inches. What did I say? 20 to 24 yeah. inches, Bubba. The nice ones. That's a nice one. Here's what they do. Just so you know, folks, they go, womp, womp. And you lift up, and they go, womp, womp. And you lift up, and they go, no, I want it. And you go, no, I want it. And you go, well, no, I want. <laughs> it's all wrapped in it. All right, there we go. Mr. Black Drum. Targeted species in the boat. <laughs> yes, sir. That's a perfect eater. What you looking for? Wait thing. I want to see if it falls right. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I gotta get them out. Grab that. See that tube right there? This one? Yeah. Pull the end off. It says, look on the end, and it says, open this end. Open here. Excuse me, it's a six pounder. Okay, grab the lid. Go ahead. Aaron's gonna do the official weight. Let me get the camera. I think I hit it, man. You hit it? Or a five and a half. Five and a half. Five and a half? Five and a half. Guess what? That's good enough. That makes the grease stank. Come on! A five and a half pounder, baby. All right. In the box goes. All right. All right. High air five. <laughs> you can't touch it. You can't touch it. All right, it's Aaron's turn. On the net cam, he's got a drag. A red piece, he's, he's got a he's got a drag screamer. Drag screamer. Come around. Come around. Don't let me stop you. Let me pull mine up. Let's hope so. Something for the box, baby. Something for the I box. Don't know. Maybe it is a redfish. Maybe it is. We're a big, big, big drum. D rum. D rum. Keep it tight, man. Don't let no slack in that line. Keep it tight, man. Keep it tight. Oh, yeah. I said, uh, who let them dogs out? <laughs> Uh-oh, we're going to get waked by the ghetto cruiser. There's a ghetto cruiser, folks. Getting waked by the ghetto cruisers. If this was a red, you would have pulled out more line, wouldn't you? No, well, maybe. I could just be a drum, man. It could be just a nice drum, baby. No. No, it ain't no stingray. Okay, got waked by the ghetto cruiser. Come on, you're done, dude. You're done. You're done. Not done. Oh man, we really are dragging anchor or something. Yeah, I know. Let me. Uh... Hey, this could be a 40 pounder, man. Yeah. I don't know, man. I've never caught one that big. 
I don't know how they feel. He might not fit in the net. Burning down the house. Be a monster drum. Spanish into the boat. Getting all tangled in the process. Getting the tangled. Ah, what, what, what are you eating over here? What's Nothing. this? Nothing. What are you eating? None of your business. None of my business? Yeah. You gonna eat those Oreos? You gonna eat that mayonnaise? Here, you can have that. <laughs> I don't want your mayonnaise. Oh, you almost. Almost littered. I think it was literally littered. Hey, you, you eating that bun? What's that? A sub. A sub? All while Dad's back here. <laughs> Dad's back here busy with mayhem going <laughs> on.